Hello and welcome to another video, another video, another corner. Today's a very exciting video. I was lucky enough yesterday to be given an iMac G3 by a family member. So today, we're gonna see if it runs, we're gonna see what's on there, and we're also gonna be installing Mac OS 9. Some of you may have seen my previous videos where I emulated Mac OS 9 on my M1 MacBook Pro and I've really wanted to use that software on actual hardware. So here's my opportunity. This model here is either the 2000 or 2001 model of the iMac G3 and it would have originally shipped with a version of Mac OS 9 20 plus years ago. So let's begin, shall we? Here's the machine booting up. We've got some questionable hard drive noises there. Apologies as well, I've not figured out how to sync the refresh rate of the CRT with the camera. I'm pretty sure this thing runs at 75 hertz so would that mean I have to film at 75 frames per second who knows we have a mouse finally and it looks like if that default wallpaper is to be believed it looks like this is panther oh, okay yeah the CMOS battery's broken let's go to Apple about this Mac and see what we've got all right so yeah it is panther version 10.3.9 it's got a 350 megahertz power PCG 3 and half a gig of RAM which is heavily upgraded over stock so we've got a few old programs down here the old suite of iLife Microsoft Word Internet Explorer Firefox Let's see when these were created, shall we? Oh my god, okay. <laughs> 22nd of April 2011. Someone was still using this machine in 2011. That's so cool. This is a family computer. There hasn't been any shockers on here so far. I've had a little rummage through and backed up what needs to be backed up. But sometimes on these old machines, you never quite know what you're getting yourself into and you stumble upon, let's just say, some rather unsavory files. <laughs> it's really cool looking at the date created label. So some of these are from 2008, 2003. Here I have my very legitimate Mac OS 9 installation CD. So I'm gonna pop that in the CD drive. It actually accepted it, which is a good start. And I'm gonna shut the thing down. Hold down Alt to get to the boot menu. Moment of truth. Did the CD work? And does the CD drive work? There we go. Fantastic. Again, sorry about the refresh rate on this. CRTs are an absolute pain to film. Ah, uh, we have the little smiling finder there. I love it. OS 9.2. That's a sight to see. That is such a treat. When I was emulating Mac OS 9 on my laptop, the mouse was really, really jittery because obviously I'm going through an emulator. This is buttery smooth and I'm really excited to use this operating system on real hardware. So here we are in the Mac OS OS 9 installation environment and I love how the window contents don't move when you drag it. <laughs> I really like this environment and I especially like how all of the drives mount automatically on this kind of fake desktop thing. I guess we'll go into utilities and we'll just erase the drive on here. So Macintosh HD, initialize. I wonder if we can change the name. Let's see. Enter. Yes. Macintosh HD. Come out of utilities and double click Mac OS install. This is so exciting. Okay, continue. Continue again. Agree. What's in customize? Network assistant client? I'll add that just in case. Start. 16 minutes. This took five minutes on the emulator. <laughs> there was an error part of the way through saying that it couldn't install one font file. So I'm assuming this is what this prompt refers to. So I'll hit continue and see how we go. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Check out that background. It's crazy how much time this takes compared to when I was emulating it. A Mac OS setup assistant. One moment, please. Except it's many moments. The entire thing appears to have just completely locked up. <laughs> I don't know if that's a hard drive problem. Okay, Australian. There we go. All right, what time is it? Not even the minutes are correct there. <laughs> it's 9.59. Time zone, Melbourne. Do not use Simple Finder. That sounds like hell. PowerPC G3. Sure, that could be the computer's name. Why not? You have not provided the password. Oh, okay. I'm just going to quit out of there. And there we go. There's our Mac OS 9 desktop. I'm going to go into control panel and monitors there. I'm going to try and get the graphic to fill the screen with geometry here. CRTs are weird. See how I'm just kind of expanding the desktop there? There we go, that'll do it. Color, can we calibrate? We can, expert mode. This is very similar to the Mac OS X one. They're all pretty well blended. I'm also gonna change the wallpaper and we're gonna use Tangerine Fusion. Oh yes. And there we go, that's Mac OS 9, fully installed. I'll be making a lot more videos on this machine. Mac OS 9 runs really nicely on this machine. Let's go into System Profiler. Oh wow, it even identifies the keyboard I'm using, Apple Pro keyboard. This is really cool. And of course, on this machine, we actually have a graphics card, unlike in the emulator, so I can actually run games. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did. I'm gonna install a lot of programs on here, so next time you see this machine, it'll be fully loaded with a whole heap of stuff. Let me know in the comments down below if there's anything in particular you wanna see on this machine. But I just know that whatever I do on here is gonna be a lot of fun. And I actually can't believe
believe how quick Mac OS 9 is running on here. I guess it wasn't used to being equipped with 512 megs of RAM. Alright, that'll do it for today. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.